Lee Feldman, uh, president of the Wine Country Curling Club, joins us with the details. Good morning to you. Hey guys, how are you? Good. It sounds a little loud out there. I, it sounds like they are really into this competition. Yes, we have lots of yellers, we have lots of sweepers, <laughs> lots of curlers all day today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Here at the station, we have more yellers than we do sweepers, unfortunately. <laughs> it's a mess here. Yeah. Uh, okay, so curling, the population, uh, popular, popularity of the sport has just exploded the last few years. Uh, what do you think is behind all that? Um, I definitely think it's one of the most interesting sports to watch, to play, to learn about. No game is the same. There's always going to be something different that happens in a game. And then uh, Team USA winning the gold medal at this year's Olympics definitely skyrocketed that popularity. And we taught close to 1,000 people how to curl this past couple of months. Wow, that's incredible. Yes. Okay, so now the whole, the wine country, uh, getting involved with having a team this year. I mean, how fun is that? Now, does everyone have a little glass of Chardonnay after we're done curling? <laughs> We do, yes, there is um, a little tradition after the every after every game where the two teams uh, get together and uh, discuss their game over a glass of wine or a glass of beer or soda. Um, that's called broom stacking. So there is wine involved in our wine country curling club. That's so great. I'm sorry, it's called what again? Broom what? It's called broom stacking. Okay. Broom stacking. That's what we're calling drinking wine yes. in my house from now on. Broom stacking. Yeah, there Great. you go. Yeah. <laughs> How many clubs did you say are going to be there today? So we have 40 teams that are competing all weekend. And that is, uh, there's four people on a team, so about 160 people. Um, I'd say six of our teams actually have newbies on them from this last oh. Olympic cycle. And then the other ones, we have people coming as far away as British Columbia, Wisconsin, Arizona, and then a lot of California cur uh, curlers are making the drive out here from San Francisco Bay Area and down in Southern California. That is fun. And there's going to be a series of games, right? So people have got lots of opportunities to come and check this out. Yes. Yeah, we will play. Um, it's every two. It's about every two and a half hours. There will be a different um, set of curlers on the ice. So the curlers get to play in a minimum of four games throughout the weekend. And uh, to get to championship, you play seven games total. Fantastic. Well, I mean, yep. if nothing so else, we will be here from. We'll be here from 7 a.m. to midnight, Monday, uh, Friday and oh Saturday. Ooh. And that is why you get to broomstack with That's the glass right. of wine afterwards. Yes. <laughs> wow. right, right. Stack an extra broom on that. That's a lot of work. Uh, we'll check in with you guys a little bit later on to get some more action going on yeah. here. That's fun. Absolutely fun. Excellent. Broomstacking. It's got to be the best part. We learned stuff. Right?